Sonny? Uh, the authorities are still searching the Hackensack River, and I got a crew out there 24-7, but so far there's it's just nothing. What's Carly doing? And she's holding up. Has Cyrus said anything about Sonny being missing? I don't think he knows. Oh, he knows. He has to meet with me, which means he thinks that Sonny's gone, and he's going to try and take advantage. I didn't know Cyrus asked to meet with you. Yeah, he called this morning. He suggested that we meet on Pier 55 out in the open. We both agreed to meet alone. Well, that would explain why Cyrus didn't say anything to me. Hey, what about, uh, what about Walker? Has he been around? Cyrus met with him last night. Do you know what they talked about? No idea. I'm never in the room when Cyrus talks to him. OK. I'll ask about Walker. No, 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 don't. Whatever happens, you need to be surprised. What do you think's going to happen? Not what Cyrus is expecting. You should get going. Well, I'm impressed. You haven't skipped a beat. You're just as efficient as you always were. I told you. I grieve for death in my own way. So you said. But what about your other loss? What other loss? Your cousin, Sonny Corinthos. I think my darling. What are you saying? What happened to Sonny? Word from my people in Jersey is Jerome wasn't alone on that bridge. Sonny was there with him and went in the water with Julian. The authorities have been searching without success. Your family hasn't told you? It happened just before Christmas. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. They all turned their back on me when I started working for you. Well, it's too bad for them. Now that Sonny's missing, they could really use an ally like you. What well, makes you think that they would want or need my help? Are you planning to make a move on him? Cyrus Renault is your brother? I just... You expect me to spell out my plans to you? But that's not going to happen. You're... Commitment to me seems questionable in this moment. Based on what? Well, it seems to me you've always been a trusted member of the extended Corinthos family. I'm, after all, Sonny trusted the secret of Dev's circumstance with you. Where are you going with this? I know all about your so-called son. OK, yeah, I did that. Sonny asked me to step up, and I did. For Sonny. For the kid. Deb's life was in danger. Sonny sweetened the pot with the garage. But how did you find out about it? Well, your mother is uh, very unhappy with the way your family treats you. Yeah. Well, she's not the only one. Mm. But it's done. Deb's dead. I like that kid. And I sure as hell don't like how they died. Well, th that's, that's not my problem. I, I actually admire what you did. But Dev wasn't a legal citizen, so I doubt Homeland Security will feel the same way. And you plan to hold this over my head? Oh, quite the contrary. I, I want to shield you from the consequences. You know, harboring illegal immigrants is a federal crime. My lawyer says you could be looking at five years in prison, not to mention the attendant charges like fraud, falsifying his identity. And there's no way Sonny could have kept Dev's status secret from those closest to him. And that's Jason and Carly, you know, probably Carly's daughter. Like I said, <sighs> made my choice. I know where my loyalties lie. Good. Because if I so much as get a whiff of you betraying me, not only will you go down for this, but the entire Corinthos clan will go down with you. And if you already knew this, why haven't you used it? Well, who says I won't? Right now, it's an insurance policy for me. But if I should step off a curb and get hit by a bus, or I mysteriously drop dead, my lawyer will notify the feds of the immigration violations around Dev. Do I make myself understood? 